hope everyone did here. Hope you're all keeping well and welcome to the channel. So I was out doing my Christmas shopping and at any shopping mall that I'm at, I always do this bog standard. I'll go and find a Pokemon shop. And obviously on my travels finding this Pokemon shop, I come across this. The Alakazam V-Box. Now you can see it's marked 1799, so I got this from my local game there. Um, this was actually released in January last year. Um, now I don't know if this is a, a reprint, I, I think it, I'm surely confident it is, but I thought I'd pick one up, it's a nice price, and you've got Evolving Skies in here, Chilling Rain, Fear Voltage, and Sword and Shield, so I thought, a couple of old packs in here, so I thought we'll pick it up and we'll open it on channel, so here we are today, so as you can see, as we get it ripped open, we do have the two promo cards in here, so that will be... There we go, so get that out of the way. Sorry for any noise of the plastic. If we can get it out. All right, so. I think one way we'll know as well if it is a reprint on the code cards itself, so I think it actually is. So we'll put this to the side, as well as this. Get the packs out of here. Boom. Right, so, put these to the side a sec. So you do get the Alakazam V card, and that is a quite a nice promo card in my opinion. Um, Alakazam is probably one of my favourite Pokemon to get in the game to play with. Um, I don't know why, I just kind of think it's a decent psychic Pokemon, and it's actually not a bad promo card to put in. And um, as well as the oversized Alakazam V card, so... Exactly the same, and it's actually not bad at all, but I'm not too fussed about the oversized cards, really, but um, it is a nice one to get, but yeah, so that's a cool card for you all, and this is, like my suspicions confirmed, so I, this is a, a, a reprint, uh, I'm not too sure when they actually come out, I, I, I tend to stop looking at certain release dates, release date, some products and upcoming ones, because I kind of like the element of surprise. So that's a code card there for you all. So the four packs that we get in, obviously Evolving Skies, we know what we can get from that. Base, Sword and Shield, so Gold Snow likes to be good from that, as well as the Lapras, Chilling Rain, the Glaring Moltres, and Vivid Voltage, the Rainbow Chunkachu. So we've all already pulled the Chunkachu out of this, but it'd be nice to get the Rainbow one. So four packs, let's see what we actually get. All right, so we'll kick it off with Vivid Voltage with the Orbital artwork. Let's see if we can actually uh, get something decent from this. Let's see if we can actually make a profit from this box. Um, and though that Viva Voltage is actually an old core card, so... 17 99 for this box. Can we profit today? Let's see. And there is something in here. Obviously with core card, but there actually is something shiny on edges. So let's see what we get. I don't really have much luck with these boxes. So I'm hoping today that changes. Clobopus, Reverse Hollow Oshawa, and we do get, <laughs> typical, or Beetle V, so we do get a hit from that, so takes a little bit off of what we've actually paid for the box, so let's see if we can emulate that with a Chilling Rain Pack, or Chilling Pain, as everyone says, and as you can see, Green Core Car, so this is the old print, but I don't think that's the reprint of the Chilling Rain, but we'll, uh, we'll do card trick anyway. And go through it. Let's see. Coffin, Shuppet, Sveal, Hatena, and a non holler Slurpuff. So, Sword and Shield. I feel like it's been ages since I've opened Sword and Shield, especially on the channel. Not open enough for it, in my opinion, because there's some nice artwork. But it is a reprint, so as you can see, it is a black border. So, let's see if we can get the. Uh, the Gold Snorlax or the VMAX Snorlax, I think it is. You could tell I've opened this set a lot. So, Baltoy. There's something in here. Let's shine up borders again. Could be another V card. Oh, ho, ho, it isn't. It's actually a full art, so we do get a Wobble Fit V. That is nice. That is clean. Let's look at that back. Do you know, that's actually not a bad card. Like, it's actually quite well centered. That is pretty sick, I'll put my sleeves away. So yeah, we do get, actually get a full art from this, so 
I feel we potentially could be uh, getting close to reaching that mark. So a Wobbuffet V, Team Rocket's favourite Pokemon. So a nice full art from there. So we've got a V and a full art. And but last but not least, Evolving Skies. Now, are we going to get anything from this? I think this will be a reprint. It's a bit reprint, I think. Oh, oh. Okay, so that's unusual. So, there's your code card. We'll check that after if it is a reprint, but I am now confused. I am now confused. Why Why was that code card there? Oh, have we got an error pack? Have we got an error pack here? That's your energy. Okay, so a Molga, Lotad, Rufflet, Punkaboo, Pikachu, Versal Sebli. And we do get an SP on V, so it is a hit. So I'm not too sure. Have we had, have we had two energies? So I'm not quite sure what happened there. But we do get another V card, an SP on V, and that is that looks pretty sick in light, in my opinion. So that is very nice, but. Don't know what happened with that pack there. Um, I thought we were on something pretty major, but either way, we do get an SP on V, and that is added to the total. So I'm gonna I'm gonna check. I'm sure I've seen two energies in here. Yeah, there were. So there were there were two energies in here. That is mad. So right, hang on, hang on. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, so twelve cards in there. That is barmy. They couldn't have given an extra uh, full art or uh, alternative art, could they? So we'll have a, a quick count up and see if we've actually met his total or gone past it. Okay, so a little recap: we pulled, we pulled the All Beetle V, as well as the Espeon V from the Evolving Skies pack, which actually wasn't a reprint pack. So, one to note for these boxes, and we did get a full art from this box, which I can't believe because my, my luck's never in with these. We do get the Wad Buffett V full art. So, a total of £9.50, so which means we're at a loss at £8.49. So, not ideal that we've lost out on the box, but we do get some pretty good hits, but... Um, Obviously, I've, in, I've enjoyed opening that today, so if you've enjoyed watching this video, be sure to smash that like button. And if you're new here today, you haven't subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. So that's going to do it for now, and I'll see you at the next one. See you there.